I'm Marcella D'Souza from the Watershed Organization Trust, India. My organization has been working in natural resources management since a long, long time, since 1989, basically. It's because we found that land degradation and water scarcity were reasons why what kept people poor. And we needed to get the whole community to work together to regenerate their lands. This was one of the reasons also for the various conflicts that were taking place in the village. However, after we got the people to integrate and, and work together on a very systematic technical approach for watershed development, we found huge successes. Agriculture had improved, there was no more water scarcity, and people had hope. But sometime around the 2000s, we started observing very weird weather changes. The monsoons were being pushed, sometimes beginning in August, sometimes in September. We had not heard it, of it before. The rains were erratic and at any time, there were long dry spells and agriculture was being seriously affected. We then had ecologic refugees who would go to, the, who would go to cities. And this was a question that we asked ourselves. Did we have to look at another creature? This creature called we called it severe weather variation. Today we say climate change, maybe. But to understand more what this creature is all about so that we could help our communities respond appropriately. That was when we realized that we had to add onto the watershed work that we were doing, the natural resources regeneration. We realized that we had to look now at sustainable adaptive agriculture, which now looked at water management and water budgeting and micro-irrigation. It looked at an improved package of practices so that the farmers could enhance the, the organic composting and make it more sustainable, increase soil health, but also with the agrimet advisories that would give them the crop-related weather advisories and so that they could then adapt agriculture according to the season. And we are beginning to see that this is productive, a good way to go ahead.